Hey man, if there was some riffs on that Beatles song we just covered, it'd be something like this. Oops. So that's basically the bass part, but it's kind of fun to play it on guitar. Uh, with that song, you can, uh, I think you can modify it a little bit. It's, the guitars are kind of mushed together, so it's kind of hard to pick out exactly what the guitar is doing. Or you could kind of do uh, an E7 up here. kind of just play around with it but the riff the bass riff is like this if you played it lower so it's E E G sharp E B B A G sharp Yeah, you can kind of just, uh, it's rock and roll. It's got a good beat. If the, bass, if the bass and drums are good and the vocals are decent, you can just kind of just fill it in the way you want, I think. E7 or E7 here or even up here. A or A7, A, A7, A7. A7, B7, or, or, and the, the hook, sometimes I'll do this G sharp into the E chord, so it's like G sharp, B, E, B, with a couple of open strings, and A, you can do C like that. And an E7, B7, E7. So just whatever you feel, just as long as you keep that driving beat going, people might dance and you might survive to play another gig. <laughs> just lock in and rock out. That's what I try to do. Just know a variety of those chords and keep the beat going and it should work. <laughs>